All right, I'm watching this. Uh, Danny Garcia and Sean Porter face off. You know, as I watch, turn it down a little bit. Danny, you can you listen to read his lips. He said he want all the smoke. He want all of it. Come on, back it up. I want all the smoke. And he looks at the <laughs> looks at the daddy and tells him all the smoke. Uh, Kenny Porter looks like he gained a little weight. He's getting that uh, he's spreading. You want all the smoke. For the vacant WBC welterweight championship of the world, Danny Swift Garcia, Showtime Sean Porter. Andrew Garcia showing respect. Uh, <clears throat> all right, let's get to this little, let's get to this fight. You gotta excuse my voice. A little sick. For me. This fight can go two ways. Danny wins, Danny gonna win by knockout. I don't think he's gonna win on scorecards. Porter wins, he wins by points. Uh, I don't think Danny can knock out Sean Porter. I'm not saying he can't hurt him, I don't think he can knock him out. Anybody can be knocked. Anybody can be knocked out, but I don't think he's gonna knock him out. When was the last time Danny Garcia had a knockout? I can't remember. Porter's a tough, rugged fighter. He smothers his own work. Sometimes, to me, is sometimes it gets a little boring watching uh, Sean Porter, because. Just it goes a distance, and Sean never hurts nobody or never really knocks him out. I think the last person he he gave the business to was Paulie Malignaggi. I'm talking about he really gave the business, and it was a clear cut, dry victory for Sean Porter. You know he went close fight with Thurman and whatnot. Uh, Brooke uh, Kell beat him, obviously. Uh, I think Porter just stylistically, I think. Uh, I think Porter going to outwork him, and I think he's going to beat him. I could be wrong. Um, if Danny beats Porter, if he does, it'll shock me. Cause I don't, cause Danny doesn't sit there and really box you. He, he, he kind of. Kind of be swinging to the fences a lot. He, he's trying to get you out of there. And I'd be shocked if Danny wins it by scorecards. I would. But, you know, this is boxing. Anything, anything can happen. <clears throat> Angel Garcia, the father, he shows, he's showing crazy respect. Um, this is the first time I've ever seen him this humble. I don't know if he's intimidated by Kenny Porter. You know, because Kenny Porter, he's not too old. He, he probably put hands on you. Um, if Sean, Sean, if Sean beats him, whoever whoever wins, not gonna hold the title that long. Especially when you got Spence and you got uh, Terrence in the same division, they're not gonna hold that belt for long. But this will be a good fight. This 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 will make this is a, be a good fight for Sean Porter to win. Um, it's a good fight to win. I think I'm going with Porter. I think Porter gonna beat him. Might be a close fight on the scorecards, but I, it, I, I'm gonna say this: if Danny Garcia can hurt visually hurt Sean Porter. He might not drop him, but if he can hurt him visually in two of the rounds, at least two rounds out of the whole fight, then I think Danny Garcia will beat him on the scorecards. I 
do. That's a big if. So my hunch says Porter going to beat him on the scorecards. That's what I'm going with. There you have it.